hello everyone welcome to my video today in this video we will model this double sprocket gear double rolled uh, let's start by opening a new part in front plane in white plane let's do that in white plane I will create a sketch and a sketch you will see as follows on the screen new part here that line and then I will create here one construction geometry I will copy this one to other side a bit continuing and then another line now I will copy all the section mirror select everything and will be here then we can close our sketch if you want you can remove this one and combine it here with a full uh, length line uh, let's start to give some dimensions this is 13 here to here we have a value of 0 1.3 these are standard values by the way for uh, the half inch uh, sprocket you can find with the then uh, code on the internet here we have 7.2 here we have got length 21 here we are going to uh, create sorry here 15 here 12 if you can create here one construction geometry we can start to give uh, full diametral dimensions Here we are going to have uh, 81, 18 plus 7, 3, 6, 5. This also comes from a calculation, which is D0 plus uh, 1.25 uh, pitch minus uh, your roller diameter. I can maybe write you here the formula for that d0 d0 minus d0 plus 1.75 pitch uh, minus d a it is roller diameter or we can say d r for this one and then later i will uh, use it again let's create now our value our uh, revolve operation here we are going to create one cutout and here one rectangle rectangle uh, this will be 30 then will will be 6 by uh, 35 and we say OK, extrude cut, selected object, up the surface, and we are going to give some chamfers. Here and here. Yes, looking fine. Now we are going to create a sketch here on this plane and I will create here one circle two timeline this is unnecessary in fact so our pitch will be 12.7 this is a half inch sprocket here so the value here 
we have 20 rollers here the value is 18 our uh, the roller diameter value our uh, pitch diameter comes from here it is uh, 81 uh, 18 this is the value the pitch is uh, 12.7 simply then the formula will be the value will be 18 plus 0.25 uh, multiply 20.7 minus if you calculate this guy and then at the end you will get our value which I placed here earlier this is the out of diameter guys sorry yes 88.55 so then we can continue we can open this sketch again roll of diameter was 8.51 and then I will create here one arc tangent then let me delete this we create a line and tangency value will be a tangent and value of that tangent line will be 20 and the radius is 17 when you're done you can do like this and right click select chain this one also selected and okay sorry here will be mirror I don't want to cut it in fact we can make trim but I ex I afraid sometimes some relations are going and then I'm pretty much annoyed that's the reason sometimes I don't want to uh, trim the object because not necessary true all sorry yes this is the guy and we select object circular pattern and 18 yes this is our sprocket looking fine I hope you could understand I hope it's not uh, very uh, complex for you guys there is some basic formula to find out the dimensions and you can find them by searching the the number of this sprocket and then you will find for different pitch different values the roller diameter will be different your pitch will be different and your thickness will be different everything will be different and then by using these tables you can model such a thing thanks for watching my video see you in another video